I remember when, as a young attorney, I was sent to the Bronx Courthouse each and every day for an entire year. You want to know why? Come join me as I share with you this great information. Hi, I'm Jerry Oginski. I'm a New York medical malpractice and personal injury trial lawyer practicing law here in the state of New York. No, I was not exiled. Instead, as a young attorney, I was a defense attorney representing people who were being sued in accidents and also medical malpractice cases. We had a lot of cases that we were handling, and I was assigned to handle the Bronx cases for an entire year. That meant that every single day I had to take all of the cases in the Bronx that were assigned for that particular day and now notify the judge in each and every courtroom that we were supposed to be in about the status of each and every case. The goal of sending me there each and every day was so that I could get to know each judge. The goal was so that I could get to know each of the clerks in each of the courtrooms. And there's a really important reason for doing that. There's a key familiarity that you get by being in some place each and every day. And that's a critical distinction. There's a totally different atmosphere when you go into a place and you've never been there before, you've been there once or twice, compared to being there each and every day. You get to know the regulars who are there often. You get to know exactly the procedures of what goes on. You get to know the specific quirks for each clerk as well as the judge's law clerk as well as the judge. There's certain things that they like to do and certain things they don't like to do. And only by going there on a regular basis can you begin to learn all that information. And that was really helpful. In addition, not only was I sent there for conferences, but I was sent to the Bronx to handle pretrial testimony, known as depositions, where I had the opportunity to question people who were bringing lawsuits, as well as people who were questioning my witnesses. And that was critical to learning how to develop a case and getting the case ready for trial. So it was a fantastic learning experience. And if you have an opportunity to go in and sit in on a case or to observe a trial, I highly encourage it because you know what? All the courtrooms, the civil courtrooms in the state of New York are open to the public. Not just in the Bronx, but in Manhattan, in Brooklyn, anywhere you go in New York, Nassau County, Suffolk County, those courtrooms are all open to the public. All you have to do is open the door, walk in, sit down, and simply observe. So why do I share this great information with you? Well, I share it with you for a little bit of nostalgia because of the fact now I've been practicing more than 25 years, and it's been many years since I've been in the courtroom each and every single day, but I have to tell you it was a fantastic experience. You know, I realize you're watching this because you probably have questions or concerns about your own particular matter. Well, if your matter did happen here in New York and you do have legal questions, what I encourage you to do is pick up the phone and call me. I can answer your legal questions. You know, this is something I do every single day and I'd love to talk to you. You can reach me at 516-487-8207 or by email at jerry, G-E-R-Y, at oginski-law.com. That's it for today's quick video. I'm Jerry Oginski. Have a great day.